Hello everyone and welcome to our lesson. So today on page 31, maths, we are going to make a pictures by using tangram. Okay, so on page 125, if we go to page 125, there will be a cut out. Okay, cut out, but don't cut this book. Okay. Do not cut this book. Instead, you take a piece of paper and you try to copy down the shapes. Okay, there are a few shapes that you need to copy down. For example, over here on your screen, we have two large triangles. One, two. This one is L large besar triangles there are two next one there will be one medium triangle okay the medium one remember two large triangle segitiga ada dua one two yang besar ah there are two and one is medium over here okay medium and then another two triangles one two but these two are small okay small triangles there will be one square okay segitiga eh segitiga segi empat uh, sama okay the square and there will be one special parallelogram over here okay on top of this big square okay only one parallelogram so uh, just in case if you wonder how to get these shapes okay i will put up the link in the description of this video I put down or I will send on your WhatsApp so that you have the perfect tangram okay for your project so next one after you use uh, you get these shapes okay you cut them out all the shapes gunting uh, you can use all magazine all papers colored papers okay no problem Let's go back to page 31. Where is it? Okay, over here. After you got your tangram, so now you can make your own pictures. Sometimes you can make a fish. I'm not sure what is this. I know this one is the kite and the small ship. Okay. So use your imagination to make shapes. For example, I've searched video on YouTube. Okay. And I found that there's an example of tangrams that we can and I are playing with tangrams. Okay, let's have a look. Tangrams are ancient Chinese puzzles. Okay, ancient there Chinese puzzle. Seven shapes. Seven shapes. Okay, is it really seven? Okay, let's have a look. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, there's the exact seven piece of pieces of shapes. Okay. All seven shapes. Or seven shapes. Create a picture. When people think of puzzles, they think of puzzle pieces. With hands, you use imagination to create endless possibilities of pictures and designs. Let's give it a try. First, okay. you have two large triangles. Two large triangles. Then you have two small triangles. Two small triangles. Then you have a parallelogram. Parallelogram. A square. Square. And a medium triangle. Medium. Seven pieces. Seven. Now, make sure there are seven, seven, okay? Try to make things happen. Let's see what we can make. Always put things in order. Therefore, you can see the pieces you use. Let's see where our imagination creates. Okay, puzzle number one, okay? Those seem to be a face, I think. Maybe ears? Mm. 
Can you guys guess what it is yet? Can you it's guess? A cat. Oh, wow. Work, let's try to make something else. Okay, let's make Remember, something else. Hmm. Seems to be at ears again. And a body. Maybe he's making another cat. Maybe another Can cat? Can you guys tell what it is? <gasps> I see it now. It's a bunny. It's Ready a bunny or a design? rabbit. Let's do it. Remember, put the pieces back in order. Mm. Puzzle 3. Hmm. This time it looks like... Maybe a tail? What is this? There you go. It's a shark. Oh, Hi, Mr. Shark. It's a shark. Mm. Ready to make another one? I am. Let's go. Okay, puzzle number four, this okay? Time, let's make something different. Different than an animal. What else do you think we can make? Hmm. There's a rectangle. A roof? <gasps> it's a house. Oh, okay. It's a wow, house. There's wow. So many things we can make. How about we make just one more tangram, okay? One more. One more. Can you tell what he's making? You guys are really great at this game. <gasps> Let's see. It's me. Oh. You guys guessed it. Is it a boy? Is tangram's fun. We love sharing activities with them. Okay, so that, those are examples of a parallelogram that we can uh, we can do on our on our own. So your homework will be how about you have this cut out after that you make one shape okay one shape one picture and send it to me so that I can see your imagination of making something out of these seven pieces of puzzle okay so I hope you have a good time playing with this old Chinese toy and I'll see you on the next lesson okay have fun bye